Hello and welcome back to another episode of Navigation Through Ocean Classification. And if you remember, in our first episode, we talked about the phylum Periphera, which includes sea sponges. And today we are going to be talking about the first class of Periphera under the phylum. The first class is going to be Calcarea, otherwise known as the Calcareous Sponges. The only class of Periphera that has every type of sponge body plan, which I will get to in a second. What makes this class unique? Their spicules are made out of calcium carbonate, much like many mollusk shells are, and hence gives this name Calcarea. There are around 400 species in this group, and they are found in shallow waters, oftentimes near coral reefs. They don't get very large, and on average only reach around 10 centimeters, but they are found at larger and smaller sizes. Typically, they seem to be very bland in their coloration, but there are some exceptions to this rule. This class has every type of sponge construction. There are three, each listed in increasing levels of complexity. Asconoid, sicanoid, and leuconoid. An example of a sponge in the calcarea class is the lemon sponge one of the colorful exceptions. Found in the Western Pacific, this sponge forms sacs that each have an opening, aka the osculum or oscula that I have talked about before in my previous episode. Another example would be the yellow lace sponge, which looks vastly different than many kinds of sponges. This sponge is an asinoid construction. I hope you all enjoyed learning more about the sponges and ocean classification and make sure to stay tuned. The next sponge class I will be going over is the Demo Spongy class. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you smash that like button and subscribe if you're not already subscribed.